Leo. How are you, Leo? I hope you are doing fantastic and amazing today. Yes. I am coming to you with your past, present and future reading. I am going to be looking at you and somebody who you may be dealing with in your experience at this time. This could be a past person. This could be somebody who you're involved with romantically now. This could be family. This could be friends. This could be anything in between. So use your discernment and only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest for somebody else. Okay. Leo, thank you for being here. Thank you to everybody who has liked, shared, commented and subscribed to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. If you are returning, I am very, very grateful to have you join me here. Please like the video. It helps my messages to get out in YouTube lives, which I very much appreciate. Right, let's see. What is going on with Leo and a person in their experience at this time? Please tell me what happened in the past for Leo, what is currently happening for Leo and what will be happening in the future for Leo and somebody who they are dealing with. Thank you, Spirit. Spirit, please guide and protect me as I channel the messages that Leo wants to know or needs to know at this time. But if you're here, you definitely want to know, Leo. Let's take a look. We're gonna be drawing four, four cards in each section. We're gonna be looking at the past first. Two more shuffles. Messages for Leo. Okay. Okay, let's see. Wow. Oof. Okay. Crone of Wands is at the bottom of the deck. Some of you Leos could be dealing with another fire sign, an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius. We've got the Four of Wands here. Knight of Swords, Page of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, Five of Cups, Ace of Wands. Okay, give me a second, Leo. Some of you could be dealing with a Pisces. Some of you could be dealing with a uh, Capricorn, Virgo or a Taurus here. Some of you could be dealing with a water sign. There's strong water sign energy in this reading. Virgo, strong as well. Leo, I feel like in the past, okay, we're going to go to the past first and then we're going to clarify. I feel like in the past... Somebody could have been watching you while holding some sort of information back from you. This is a person who possibly wanted to tell you something in the past with the Page of Swords. Pages are messengers in the tarot. And with the High Priestess, there was something that was hidden or something that somebody may have been keeping from you. This specifically could have been a Gemini, a Libra or an Aquarius. Or this could have been a Pisces in your environment that was kind of watching, wanted to say something, but keeping it to themselves. There was something that this person wanted to talk to you about or tell you. I feel like you, Leo, you are in the past, you was you had a lot on your plate, okay? You could have been kind of juggling a lot at the time. Um, so I don't know how kind of tapped in you may have been to what this person may have wanted to talk to you. This person could have been somebody who wasn't really in your experience or somebody who you didn't kind of see in your vision because you had other things going on, okay? I get that in the past, maybe you were very busy. You could have been very busy with work growing a business, 
establishing something about your finances your, or your stability some of you were just very heavily focused on your tangible world okay things of the 3d stability that you can have and attain for yourself and i feel like there was a lot that you could have been juggling and a lot that was on your plate okay this may have been the reason why this person was, was kind of watching and holding something back they may have felt like they didn't have there was no space for them or something about them not really having a window of opportunity to approach you because possibly you were preoccupied with a lot of other things in your environment hence the reason why this person may have decided to keep something quiet we're going to see what this information is that this person wanted to tell you okay but i've got a idea what this may be looking at the rest of the the cards here but let's just clarify here yeah 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 leo this is a person again there's fire sign energy aries leo sagittarius a lot of you could be dealing with one of those signs or you have other fire placements because obviously leo is a fire sign um but you you may have strong aries or sagittarius as well in your chart or you're dealing with one in the past where your focus was on your tangible world you know building some sort of stability for yourself somebody here was keeping a secret from you um about some sort of feelings that they had for you that were developing this person is in love with you or was at least in the past okay and this is something that again with that four of pentacles we've got the ace of cups the king of cups and the four of pentacles this person was holding back a lot of feelings they up there they were up in their emotions there's a lot of water energy scorpio pisces cancer OK, again, you could be dealing with some one of those signs or, you know, that could be um, energies that you have in your chart as well. This person had a lot of feelings for you that were held back. And I feel like it was just that this person didn't feel like there was space for them or it's like they, they didn't see a window of opportunity to kind of avert to try and avert your focus to what you was focusing on so this is a person who had a lot of feelings for you but was keeping that from you okay and it's because they felt like your focus was elsewhere maybe they felt like you may not have been interested in love or what they had to say at that time in the past okay moving to the future hang on let's just see what this uh two of pentacles and the crown of pentacles is yeah justice some of you could work in the legal field you could have had something going on with the justice system as well doesn't have to be yeah a lot of you were kind of strategically trying to work towards something here for some of you you had a legal case that you may have had to deal with somebody could have taken from you or stolen from you that's a side note and maybe you were dealing a, with some sort of injustice or something that may have been going on in your environment due to the legal system or due to something that may not have been fair with you in the past or somebody in your experience that was aside from this person up here that we're discussing okay i just wanted to clarify that but i also feel like you had a lot going on with you trying to build some sort of finances and stability in your life as well moving to the current okay current energy we've got the two of cups and the queen of pentacles with the ace of pentacles and the hermit energy a lot of you could be spending time by yourself at this time a lot of you could be in, in very much a reserved energy okay i feel like maybe in the past you had a lot going on you were juggling a lot as i've said and now you're in a place where you're more calm things have calmed down okay you may be spending a lot of time by yourself a lot of you could be enjoying that downtime that time by yourself this kind of lone wolf sort of energy okay with the hermit card okay and i feel like it's due to the fact that you may have been so busy in the past with doing a lot of things that now you're embracing the calm now you're embracing you know not having so much chaos so much juggling you know multiple plates spinning at the same time i'm getting an image of a circus i don't know okay that might resonate with somebody somebody's coming forward to you leo with a really big offer this is an offer of stability okay this person who has kind of held back from you you know with a lot of feelings really deep feelings here up in their feelings emotions besotted with you absolutely besotted with you leo this person's coming forward with something here 
with an offer. This could be somebody, you know, who very much matches your energy in terms of your ethic. Because remember, you were, you were showing up as that crone of pentacles, which is also the king of pentacles. And now here we've got the queen of pentacles, okay? Queen of pentacles and the two of cups. This is somebody mutual. The two of cups talks about mutual love. It talks about mutual feelings, okay? It talks about being on the same page as well, and partnership. And with the Queen of Pentacles, this is somebody who's been watching by the sidelines and seeing themselves as a really good fit for you, Leo. And with the Queen of Pentacles, this person's biting the bullet and coming in. But I feel like this is because you're in more of a reserved energy. I feel like you've let go of a lot of burdens, things that you may have been dealing with, a lot of things that you may have ju been juggling simultaneously. So a person now sees the window of opportunity to come in and to make it known the feelings that they have for you here. With the Ace of Pentacles, this is a new offer that is coming in manifesting but it's due to you kind of letting go of things and again stepping into this hermit energy where you don't have so much going on this person is gonna be shooting their shot with you here leo let's clarify two of pen two of cups queen of pentacles the empress oh my goodness this person could want children with you leo two of cups oh my goodness leo page of cups they definitely could want children with you so if you sorry i'm dramatic guys i have to if you are of childbearing age masculine or feminine this is a potential for children union something that is going to grow oh my gosh i just got this really warm feeling tingles butterflies all at once empress two of cups page of cups oh they want you leo two of cups is here twice this is a person who wants to share with you this is a sorry if i'm just being really soppy this is a person who wants to indulge in a relationship with you leo this is a person who sees growth with you and press energy they love you they want to grow with you if this is a feminine energy this is a person who wants to have children with you there's a big energy of children here taking things to the next level, giving birth to something new. And for a lot of you, it might be a child here. Oh, clarify this hermit energy. Yeah. OK, Leo. So where you've been in this very kind of juggling energy, creating something stable for yourself. I feel like you being in this hermit energy it's kind of like you're, you've meticulously worked towards some sort of independence. For some of you, you could have been in a very fight type of energy, you know, where you wanted to gain this stability at all costs, okay? And now you've done that, something has come to completion. This energy of feeling like you need to kind of, you know, get it done. Stability, money, money, money. You could have been heavily money focused, heavily focused on some sort of attainment, stability, abundance that you were working towards. And now you're moving into a new cycle where you are able to kind of sit back. For some of you, you've kind of attained a certain level where you're satisfied. And now you have freed up some space, okay? Where you could have been very closed off in the past. You are open, okay? Ace of Pentacles is here twice, okay? This is reciprocal. So you have an offer on the table and you're also willing to give an offer after closing out this cycle of possibly juggling a lot, working on your stability, working on your abundance. And now there is space for love. I see it here. Moving to the future, okay? I feel like you're going to be in an energy of feeling very carefree. You're going to be immersing yourself into a new a new um, environment here, a new environment, a new person. You're going to feel like you've met somebody who you're very connected to in a very big way. This is a soulmate energy. This is somebody who you're going to be enjoying a lot of fun times with. Again, there's children in the Six of Cups, okay? Celebration. A lot of you may, may I'm hearing baby shower. I'm hearing wedding reception. I'm hearing engagement, okay? This is a celebration of union. This is something where you're going to be having a lot of fun. You're going to be stepping into a more lighthearted energy in your energy so far leo there's very little emotion in your specific energy and i feel like as you move into this new cycle you are opening up to being more emotive being more 
emotionally expressive and making space for love for you know attaining some sort of level of connection with people on a very deep level and this is something that is serving as some sort of new beginning for you after possibly being in an energy of you know feeling like you've got to work really hard feeling like your focus is all on things that you've got going on as opposed to love temperance yeah you're balancing some sort of energy and you're going to be moving forward okay there's a neutralization that's coming in your energy with the eight of wands and the chariot card and with temperance here this is you feeling like you are going to be moving into balance again temperance talks about patience but it also talks about balance and peace i get you being able to kind of sit back a bit and just kind of be in your emotions and balance that out balance your tangible with your emotions and have a really equal playing field to kind of have a relationship that is going to be flourishing stepping into your heart space and assuming really strong bonds with people in your environment here page of pentacles there's a strong energy of children i'm telling you queen of wands six of swords yeah some of you may be tempted to go back to an old way of being or being very money focused and there's nothing wrong with having your goals there's nothing wrong with attaining um, a certain level of success that's also important for your life but I get a sense that maybe you might have a bit of second thoughts as to whether or not you are going to be surrendering to this new connection or you know coming more from a, a heart space as opposed to a place of needing to work on your pentacles constantly okay with the four of wands you definitely have an opportunity for some sort of union, okay, coming together. For some of you, it could be marriage, taking things to the next level. And, you know, I feel like you're going to be giving into this, this balance of being able to offer something and, you know, be confident in whatever it is that you're going to be embarking in, in this new relationship. I feel like this is something that is going to be a challenge for you because I definitely feel like before now, before encountering this person, you could have maybe have not been considering love or love may not have been on your top priorities, you know, and I feel like there's sort of a walking away of you having any self-doubt or feeling like something would go wrong if you don't always constantly work on your stability this is about finding balance leo and i definitely see you working towards some sort of balance and this person who's coming in who wants this growth with you who wants this expansion with you who has a really brand spanking new offer shiny offer on the table they're going to be able to change your perspective about love and have you open up to them in a different way than what I see you've opened up in the past, okay? It's time for balance, Leo. It's time for you to come more from a heart space, okay? Because there's a really good opportunity for a really good, for a really good, I was going to say good opportunity twice, for a really fruitful, expansive relationship. Somebody loves you, Leo. Somebody loves the pants off you. Don't miss out. Don't miss out on love. Leo, that is what I have for you. If you like how I read, please like, share and subscribe to the channel. But until next time, Leo, I will see you soon. You take care. Bye.